Hello friends, welcome to A to Z Dentistry. This video focuses on important MCQs related to anchorage. Intraoral sources of anchorage include alveolar bone, teeth, musculature, all of the above. All of the above. Intraoral source of anchorage include alveolar bone, teeth, musculature. Then extraoral source of anchorage includes cranium, back of the neck, facial bones. Which of the following root forms provide maximum anchorage? Flat root, a round root, triangular root, all of the above. Triangular root. Triangular root of maxillary central incisor, lateral incisor and canine provides maximum anchorage compared to flat and round roots. The tooth that provide maximum anchorage is mandibular molars. Connection of single tooth crossbite using crossbite elastics is an example of single anchorage, reciprocal anchorage, Reinforced anchorage, muscular anchorage. Reciprocal anchorage. In reciprocal anchorage, two units of teeth move towards each other with equal distance. Example of reciprocal anchorage. Closure of midline diastema. Use of crossbite elastics. Dental arch expansion, all of the above. All of the above. Closure of midline diastema, use of crossbite elastics, dental arch expansion, all these are examples of reciprocal anchorage. Anchorage in which more than one tooth with greater alveolar support used to move teeth with lesser support. Simple anchorage, stationary anchorage, reciprocal anchorage, compound anchorage. Compound anchorage. In compound anchorage, more than one tooth with greater alveolar support used to move teeth with lesser alveolar support. Which of the following is an example for muscular anchorage? Use of lip bumper, use of inclined plane, use of transpalatal arch, all of the above. Use of lip bumper. It's an example of muscular anchorage. Type of anchorage in which tooth to be moved and the anchorage unit situated in the same arch. Intermaxillary anchorage, intramaxillary anchorage. Compound anchorage, muscular anchorage. Intramaxillary anchorage. Baker's anchorage is a type of intermaxillary anchorage, intramaxillary anchorage, compound anchorage, muscular anchorage. Intermaxillary anchorage. In this type of anchorage, the resistant unit situated in one jaw and the tooth to be moved situated in the opposite jaw. Anchorage in which more than one type of resistant unit is utilized. Intermaxillary anchorage, intramaxillary anchorage, reinforced anchorage, muscular anchorage. Reinforced anchorage. In reinforced anchorage, more than one type of resistant unit is utilized. Which of the following is the type of reinforced anchorage? Use of inclined plane, use of anterior bite plane, use of posterior bite plane, all of the above. Use of inclined planes. Examples of reinforced anchorages, use of inclined plane, Use of transparatal arts, use of implants.
it's all about the topic anchorage thank you